Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Click with Bricks, where we're the click that sticks together. My name is Patrick and I'm going to continue my April Showers Bring May Flowers theme uh, this week with Botanical Collections Succulents. Now not all succulents are flowers, but some of them do flower, so that counts, right? Um, but, you know, no matter what, this thing is really, really um, pretty. It's very colorful, it's very um, textured and vibrant, and it's going to be amazing once it's complete, so I can't wait to get it together. Uh, so we'll do that real quick, and then if you want to stick around after, we'll show you the unboxing so you can see what all is inside, and then we'll do a completed review of the uh, finished model. So uh, with that said, let's get started.
All right, the Botanical Collections Succulents. Um, looks like this one is a push to open, so it'll be nice and easy. You know, really good, uh, just show those just real quick on the back. Really nice pho photographs of what these completed models look like, so exciting. All right, and inside, oops, a few bags, of course. These are always fun to put together, because as soon as you open that bag, they roll everywhere. Uh, now the instructions come in one of the little envelopes. three sets because um, there's a lot to build in a way it's a few different models because they you know you can have them displayed separately so yeah the instructions are just the instructions nothing stand out in them it looks like oh no there is okay so in the first bag or in the first uh, instruction, it does give a nice little write-up, so I'll read that here shortly. About the design process and inspiration and stuff. Cool. I like when they have stuff like that. Kind of makes it uh, feel a little more personal. So, all right, well, there it is. So there's the unboxing, and uh, now that we have that done and we actually have the set together, uh, let's take a look at the completed one. Okay, and here they are, the completed succulents, all nine of them. Um, now, this was a really, really fun build, actually. Uh, it seemed intimidating when you first start, because as you can tell, there's a lot of little elements there. But that was part of the fun, um, actually trying to get them all figured out. And um, they, they were bagged really well, so it's not like it was that difficult. But still, it was challenging and straightforward at the same time, which is a fun mix when you're putting these things together. Um, now, one thing that was really interesting, I thought, was when putting them together, actually in the instructions, it does give a little bit more about each one. Um, it does give their name and a um, little factoid about them and all that kind of stuff. Uh, like, for instance, those grapey looking ones there, it's called the Burroughs Tale. So that is interesting. I did not know that. Um, it is, uh, what does it say? It's a tropical plant native to Mexico and Central America. So, hey, I just learned something about botany. Kind of. Um, and then it goes on to say that uh, the plump green leaves are used with uh, Lego dinosaur eggs. So, hey, real knowledge and uh, Lego knowledge, I guess. There you go. And it has a little bit of everything. Um, you know, for each of the sets too, kind of talks about what they are, what they're made of. So that was that was neat. But I'm not going to go through each one because uh, this is not a uh, botany class. This is just working on and completing and enjoying these wonderful sets. And this really is um, amazingly colorful, wonderful textures. Um, these can be rearranged as well if you want to make them into a different pattern or if you want to have them separate as individuals it's kind of cool it's flexible like that but yeah not too much uh, really to speak on at this point anymore um you know it again straightforward fun um wonderful really uh, really happy with how this turned out whoever um, came up with this design did an amazing job so uh, kudos to you well thank you so much for checking this one out and uh, we will see you at the next one take care then mm, bye bye